All right, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name's Matt and uh, today We got a vape box September vape box. Oh, yeah, always excited for these. This is the enthusiast plan um, So if you if you've seen my vape box videos, you know what this is about if you haven't just a little quick thing This is the enthusiast plan that vape box offers um, It's always 210 mls of e-liquid and you usually get a couple pieces of hardware and um, you can get Specific with the plans and what you'd like as far as hardware um, on their website. You can, if you're watching this through my playlist, my first video, I show you how to set all of that up. So um, you can check that out if you're interested. A um, little bit of what I've been vaping on uh, the Super Tarnished um, Vindicator. I blanked out for a second there. Vindicator 21700 with that Blotto RTA on top, Vaping Bogan in Dovpo. Inside of that, we got some uh, Mr. Vinyl and Vapors PB Party, and uh, it's just an awesome liquid, awesome RTA. I'm going to have a video coming up for this RTA soon. Yeah, just great. So that's a little bit of what I've been vaping. Before we get into the, uh, the vape box video, I want to just talk quickly about... Um, a little bit of news and advocacy, what's going on. The Trump administration has suggested and uh, they're trying to put into effect a full flavor ban. Um, so all I want to say about that without going into further detail, probably going into further detail this Saturday, we do our live stream in the clouds, 7.30 p.m. Eastern time, so you can definitely make sure to check that out. Um, it's just, just advocate, get on Twitter. See everything that's going on Twitter. Go on uh, kasad.org. I'm pretty sure it is. Sign up for that. It's free. You know, tweet at the president. You know, call your representatives. I just, I can't stress it enough. Do all of that. And, um, you know, the fight's not over. So, all right. Well, on that note, let's get into, uh, let's get into the vape box. You guys know how I do this. We're going to go down low. We're going to take a look at all the, uh, all the labeling, tell you everything about each flavor that I got. And then um, I actually set up two devices, so we'll be able to try out two flavors, which is kind of like a new thing. Usually I don't test out any of the flavors because I always get like four or five bottles of uh, liquid, and that's just a lot of devices to set up. And then if I don't like a liquid, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, let's get down there. Let's check out this Vape Box September edition. All right, here we are on the down low. Um, yeah, so usually vape box the way they do it. They have a menu. They have some uh, usually it's some cardboard shredding as uh, packaging. I already went and pulled that out. So yeah, you get a menu. Um, tells you everything that you got in your uh, your vape box. So it'll say Matt's September vape box menu. And uh, I guess I'm just gonna start to slowly go through all this. Give you a quick peek right there. First up, we have. Blood Orange Cactus Cooler by a company called Fruta and the profile on that is a Blood Orange Tangerine and Cactus. Um, it's a 60 ml bottle as you can see it is 3 milligram and it is 65% on the VG uh, and this bottle retails for $20 and it says because you like fruit flavored e-liquids. It says e-juices I just go e-liquids because I just don't like the word juice. Um, what seems interesting to me is the uh, the cactus. So the labeling is pretty straightforward. I mean, it's got a got a little floral pattern going on. Um, black. Bear with me. I'm just on the tail end of a cold here. If I sound kind of congested, um, so no complaints with the uh, with the labeling. So yeah, blood orange cactus cooler by Fruta. Let's get on to uh, to our next one. Our next liquid right here is uh, Neon Sour Ice by Vape Seasons. It is a sour gummy candy with menthol. 70-30 on a VGPG. It is three milligram as well. Uh, this whole box is three milligram. And it is another 60 ml bottle. And it says because you like menthol flavored e-juices. Um, as far as the labeling, pretty straightforward. You got a blue and a little neon at the bottom there where it says Neon Sour Ice. Um, I kind of like it. Not full clarity on that e-liquid. Um, pretty straightforward as far as the labeling goes. I, I like it. I think it's clean, crisp. Nothing, you know, nothing to, you know, complain about on that. So let's check out the next liquid. I think you guys know this company. If you've watched any of my other vape box videos, I get a lot of liquid from this company. 
Fresh Farms. This is strawberry farm cake and it is described as a strawberry butter cake. Another 60 ml bottle. Retails for $20. It is 65% on the VG and it says because you like baked good flavored e-juices. Now the thing I love about Vapebox is like it's not indefinite. You can always change up your your uh, your flavor profile on their website, you know, for your next month, you know. So if you decide like I've had enough of bakery uh flavored e-liquids the last couple months, I want to switch it up. You can always do that, which is great. Um as far as the labeling goes on this, it looks like we have orange and green going on. It looks kind of I can't tell if those are leaves or it's supposed to be like uh like little dimples that you get in like bread or cake. Um fresh farms with a little barn action going on pretty straightforward on that this is definitely a darker darker liquid that strawberry and uh, really kicking in on that um, I'm excited to try this one uh, yeah so let's get on to our last liquid and if you can see this tiny guy right here this is our last liquid this is a 30 ml bottle it is called loophole by a company called abstract and it is described as a creamy and tangy mango mango peach rings $15 on the retail, it's $70.30 on a VGPG, and it's because you like candy flavored e liquid. Um, the labeling on this, pretty straightforward, it's just orange, goes right with their, uh, with their description, nothing crazy. Uh, we've got a little design on the front there. Yeah, I like it. Nice, clean, clean, all the labels have been clean in this one. Sometimes you get, you know, stuff that's, uh, you know, like supposedly, uh, you know, like kid targeting, quote unquote kid targeting. But the companies that I've seen lately, as far as um, liquids and vape boxes and stuff, all the labeling is people are starting to, you know, just play it safe. Even though you should be able to put whatever label you you want and all that, we know all that. But yeah, the labels are just getting cleaner and cleaner, and I like the look. So let's get into the hardware that we got this month. Can never have enough cotton. Got some cotton thread samples here. Two threads and a short lump never have enough cotton. I love cotton threads and they pretty much come in every uh, enthusiast plant vape box that I've gotten and I just I never have enough cotton. You're always re-wicking and trying different flavors and stuff so the more cotton the better and cotton threads makes it very easy with that shoelace style end it just goes right in. Um, very simple. I love it. So that's one. And on the other we got the Ocula RDA um, Gold and uh, it is uh, it retails for $28. Um, it's 24 millimeter with a uh, very awesome clamp style design. As you can see, it's showcased right in the box. Look at those big beefy clamps. If you haven't seen my video on the Ocula RDA, I'll uh, I'll put a link in the description or maybe a link right up in one of these little corners here. And uh, yeah, and that's the other thing with vape box too is like I try and stay up to date buying. Uh, the latest RDAs that I think are going to be good or that I like, but it's like these guys just keep right up with it. So if you have an enthusiast plan, unless you want like a crazy amount of RDAs, you're likely to get an RDA or whatever you sign up for on the website, you know, once a month. Uh, last month we got the Passage, a month before that we got the Recurve Duel. Um, so these guys really just stay up to date, <clears throat> excuse me, on um, on their hardware. Yeah, so pretty awesome vape box. Let's go back up top. We'll try out two of our liquids, and then we'll get you guys out of here. Cool. So we are back up top here. We got two liquids that we're going to try out real quick here. We have that icy season that is the um, sour gummy worms with a menthol, and I have that in the Turk V2 sitting on that Jackaroo. Gotta love this mod. I have a review up for that. It's omen out. It says 0 .07. Um, it was around a 0 .08, 0 .10. Um, so we'll see. Hopefully it still fires. I, I already uh, I already opened up this liquid and had it going in here. So hopefully the ohms didn't drop and it won't fire. I forget what the lower end of the resistance is on this mod. Um, so yeah, let's give it a let's give it a few vapes and drip a little more in the top here. Gotta love this Pro Series drip tip. It's still big enough so that you can. Uh, you know, drip a little bit in there. So we'll drip a little bit in here. Uh, we'll probably play a little music. I'm going to vape this a little bit and I'm going to tell you guys what I think. So here we go.
Hopefully that's not too loud. I just wanted to turn on that fan. So, yeah. Icy, I, I want to keep wanting to say Icy Trio. It's Neon Sours Ice by Icy Season Menthol Sour Gummy Worm. And let me just start off by saying that the, uh, the menthol in this is strong. You get the gummy worm, but it's very subtle, um, at least in my opinion. The menthol um, is pretty overpowering, but like I like that. So you get the you get a little bit of the sour uh, the sour gummy worm on the inhale, um, a lot a lot of menthol on the inhale, and then on your exhale you get more of that sour gummy worm. So it's definitely like a very subtle um, flavor in the overall liquid as far as the sour gummy worm goes. Next up, we have the Fresh Farms. Let's see if that'll clarify enough. The light might be too bright. Fresh Farms. That's the Strawberry Farm Cake. Um, I'm excited about this one. Got that in the Goat RDA. Get that to clarify. That nice goat, sorry, dead goat. <laughs> On the Vapor SO Gen. Drip a little more of that in here. Love this RDA with this huge bore on the drip tip up top. Um, gonna read the profile one more time on this. That is a, it's just strawberry butter cake. So that was simple. Strawberry butter cake. Here we go. Dead goat, 0.10 in ohms, 96 watts. We're gonna vape it a little bit and we'll talk about it. That right there is a very, very, very sugary, sweet liquid. Um, crazy amount of wattage just blowing clouds on that dead goat. Um, yeah, you get a lot of the strawberry and there's a creamy, like the buttery, creamy taste right up front, right out the gate, bunch of strawberry, and it is just like spot on. Like if I was gonna have a strawberry butter cake, a slice of strawberry butter cake, that's it right there. It is spot on, it is crazy sugary. If I'm right, this was 65% VG. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I guess we'll find out if it's a coil killer. Um, as I look at the wrong one here, we'll find out. It's uh, it's definitely very yellow. You can see that. Um, but it is good. That is very good. These two flavors, man. I'm gonna be vaping the crap out of these two flavors. I might be putting this, might be putting that peanut butter down for a while while I get these two guys going. Um, yeah. So. I guess that's a new little segment. Didn't really know how much how to do it, to be honest. I just kind of wanted to try a couple of the liquids that I get in my vape box so that it's not just the same repetitive, boring, like, this is what I got. This is the labeling. Yeah, I think this is okay. Blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, let's go over the, the, total, the total and the savings and all of that. So here we go. We got a total of 210 mLs of e-liquid. That was three 60 mLs and a 30 mL. We, so that was four liquids in total. We got two hardware. You always get cotton threads. Cotton threads are great. Like I said, can't have enough cotton. We got the Ocula RDA. Awesome RDA. Awesome clamp design there. Um, the total retail on this was $106. We spent $60. So if you have the enthusiast plan, it's $60 and then you know your cost of shipping. So you saved $46. Now if you're if you like to go to shops, that's great. I like to go to shops too, but I also have this subscription plan because everybody knows it's great to support local businesses, of course, but you just can't beat these prices. $60 plus shipping, I got two, sorry, I got 210 mLs of e-liquid, an RDA, and some cotton. It's just great. So if you have any interest in that, head over to vapebox.com. You can sign up. There are other plans. Um, you know, if you just want uh, e-liquid or if you want, you know, nicotine salts, they have all of it over there. So that's all I have for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, if you haven't done so already, pre uh, please subscribe. Um, like this video if you like it. Th give me a comment down in the comment section, positive, negative. Let me know why you liked it, why you didn't like it. You can turn on that bell so you get post notifications every time I post a video. And... Um, yeah, check out uh, check out the In the Clouds live stream this Saturday, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. And uh, we might just be giving this away. I already have an Ocula. I have a black Ocula. So probably going to be giving this away. Come hang out and chat. See what we have to talk about. Stick around to the end and you could win this Ocula. I just asked that you're 21 in a, a little $2 charge. And uh, yeah, it could be yours. So uh, thanks again for watching, guys. And uh, I hope you have a good morning, a good afternoon. 
good evening or good night. And remember, it doesn't matter what you're vaping as long as you're not smoking.